Hey everybody, my name is Jordan. Thanks for joining me today. We're gonna be going through a quick 15 minute upper body workout and I'm gonna be using some dumbbells today. So if you have a set of weights at home, if you wanna grab those, get ready to go. We're gonna start first off with a three minute warm up for those arms. I'm gonna have you take those arms straight out to your sides, starting with some small circles forward. Now, we're gonna just do a bunch of stuff here with the arms. The shoulders are gonna be on fire when we get done. Um, so when we're standing here, um, I want you to make sure you have a slight bend in those knees. Just make sure you're not locked out here. So just a little bend, nice and easy. We're gonna be changing moves here every 20 seconds. Now, reverse those, sticking with the small circles. So this is going to serve as your warm up today, but not only that, it's going to be a pretty darn good workout um, by the end of the three minutes. Good. Keep going here. Make sure you're also breathing as we're going through this. All right. Next up, we're going to press those arms up over your head. So starting here, press it up and down. Press it straight up. Take it down. Good. If overhead movement bothers your shoulder at all, you could always just push straight out in front of you if that feels better. Good. Now we're gonna take those arms to 90 degree bend and take it here and open. Here, open up, good. So we're doing this for the first couple minutes just to get nice and warm before we pick up those weights. All right, taking those arms straight out to your sides again. We're gonna go big circles forward. Good. We're gonna keep these big circles going, but now we're gonna go ahead and reverse it. All right, those arms are gonna come straight out to your sides, palms facing forward, in and out, in and out. Probably feeling it by now. We've got a couple moves left, two to go after this. Good. All right, next move, arms straight down by your sides, up and down. Palms face the ground on this one. A little lateral raise. All right. Next up here, arms straight out to your sides. Pulse. This is going to be your last 20 seconds. We'll give those arms just a quick little rest and then we're going to get into the workout with the weights. We're gonna keep things moving today because we don't have a lot of time together. I wanted to make this workout for anybody on a time crunch. So it's 15 minutes here and done. All right, go ahead and rest. All right, and give you a little time before we pick up those weights because once we pick up the weights, we are gonna go. Not a whole lot of rest time for you. This workout is great. Um, by itself if you're really short on time for the day. It's also a great one to combine. Um, you could do it with one of my other videos such as a walking video. Combine it with your own workout routine. It's a nice thing to throw in um, your day because you can fit it in anywhere. All right, so um, moves today are gonna last about 20 seconds each. Um, so we're gonna go ahead, pick up a set of weights. I have a set of fives here, but you can use whatever um, depending upon your fitness level. Little bend in those knees, we're gonna start with lateral raises. So straight out to your sides. Now when I say straight out to your sides, you do wanna be angled forward a little bit, not directly out. A little bit safer for that shoulder. You should be able to just kinda see those weights in your peripheral vision. All right, we're gonna keep going with lateral raises, but now we're gonna alternate. So it's gonna be pretty quick switches, a lot of variety going on. You're not doing anything really for more than about 20 seconds today. All right, good. So now we're gonna switch up to front raises. So straight out away from the body, take it back down. Uh, 
Awesome job. All right, we're gonna keep going with front raises, but let's go ahead and alternate now. We're gonna go with one more on each side right here. All right, now we're gonna combine those two. So it's gonna be a lateral raise and a front raise. Lateral raise out to the side and a front raise, good. All right, shoulders are feeling good. Now we're gonna alternate all that. So it's gonna be side side, and then front and front. Since this is a little longer sequence, we're gonna hang out with this one for 40 seconds. But we are already about that halfway point. We're gonna go 20 more seconds on these shoulders and the shoulders are gonna get a little rest. Good, keep going. We're gonna do one more each direction, side, side, and front, front. All right, palms flip up. Let's take it bicep curls. Shoulders get a little rest after all that. Make sure you're keeping a little bend in those knees. You just don't want them locked out at any point. All right, now we're gonna take one arm, bend it up to 90 degrees. We're gonna go five curls on this side. Here's two, here's three, four, five, and switch. Same thing. Here's one, two, three, four, five, and switch. One more time each side. One, two, three, four, and there's five. Five, switch it up. One, two, three, four, and five. Alternating bicep curls now. One arm at a time. Control it up, control it back down. Good. 10 more seconds. <clears throat> We are gonna switch now to a hammer curl. So palms face in towards the body, curl it up and down, up, down. Awesome job. All right, we're gonna take one arm up now to that 90 degree bend and we're gonna go five, four, three, two, and one, all right, switch it up. Here's five, four, three, two, and one. One more time each side. One, two, three, four, and here's five. Let's switch again one last time. Here's two, three, four, and Five, we're gonna alternate now, keeping those palms in. Hammer curls, good. Awesome job, keep yourself moving right here. 10 more seconds. We've got some tricep work coming up next. All right, we're gonna take both of those weights, bring them together. If that's too heavy, you can always drop one we're gonna go tricep extensions. So take it all the way up, lower those weights to your upper back. We you wanna keep your biceps in by the ears the whole time. Good. All right, perfect. You can set one weight down for right now. We're gonna do a single arm tricep extension. Weight is in your right hand, right foot steps back. Left elbow to that left knee. You're gonna extend. So all you're doing is bending that elbow and straightening it out. Bend and straighten. Bend and straighten. Good. All 
All right, time to go ahead and switch that up to your left hand. Left foot is back, right elbow down to that right leg. Elbow stays in by your side. Go ahead, straighten, extend it out here, good. Back stays nice and flat. Last one. Excellent. All right, let's pick up that other weight here. This next one, you're going to kind of push your hips back. Back stays nice and flat. Pull those weights back to your hips. A little bent over row. Good, nice job. All right, we're gonna go lawnmower row now. You can take one weight, or if that's too light, you can actually hold on to both of your weights here. We're gonna start in that right hand. Big step back, just like we did with those tricep extensions. And now you're gonna pull your weight or weights back to that hip, keeping that elbow in. So this is to work those back muscles. Good. One more here on this side. And then we're gonna switch those weights over now to your left hand. Big step back with that left foot. Same thing, lawnmower row here again. Last one. Very good, stand up nice and tall. Roll those shoulder blades back. We're gonna go lateral raises. We're gonna do just a couple more minutes of work, covering a lot of what you've seen already. Find a little burnout here for that upper body. Keep breathing. Let's go front raises. Good, let's go two more. And let's alternate those two. So lateral raise and a front raise, good. Take it out and straight ahead. One more each direction. And we're gonna take those arms down, flip the palms up, bicep curls. We're gonna be switching next here to hammer curls. One more bicep curl. Palms face towards the body. Keep it going. All right, nice job. We're gonna go ahead and take both of those weights Together, you can drop one if you need to, if this is too heavy. Let's go with the tricep extension. Got just a couple moves left here. Almost done with your quick upper body workout. See those arms are feeling it by now. Let's take two more. And last one, very good. All right, bent over row. So hinging at the hips. We're gonna pull both weights up to those hips. Keep that back nice and flat. Core is engaged. Good, let's take three more here. Last two. Last one. And set those weights down. Shake those arms out. Let's take a real quick stretch here together. Take one arm across the front of your chest. 
I'm gonna go just through very bare minimum with the stretches. If you have extra time to add some more on, please do, but I wanted to keep this video short for you today to be able to throw into your day anywhere you can. Go ahead, switch it up over to the other side. As I mentioned in the beginning, this is a great workout to add on, maybe with something else, but it also works really well on those days that you're pressed for time. All right, outside of that, you guys, I've got nothing else for you today. Thanks so much for joining me.